shoot. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think he has confidence in me to shoot. Um, I've been shooting well in practice as of late, so, yeah, I mean, that's a good feeling. Jared, how, how much of a sort of a dream has this season been for you so far? I mean, I, don't, I would imagine that when you came into this year, you didn't expect to have what happened in the opener happen and to be on the floor as much as you have been. Um, I mean, for me, it's really fun just being out on the floor, like you said. Um, but at the same time, we're not really playing well, so um, I'm not really happy, I guess, right now because we're not playing the, the way we can play. So at one, at one end, it is kind of like a dream being out there, but at the same time, we got to get better. What, what's missing? Why aren't you playing as well as you think you guys need to be playing? Uh, shoot. I don't know. Um, we just got to compete, really. That's what Cal's been preaching all week. Just we got to compete harder and play harder, really. That's it. Cal said that, that you were one of the guys that was in the gym all the time last year, and it may be an exaggeration, but said you hadn't been in there one time this year before mm-hmm. he started cracking the whip, and now you're in there all the time. How yeah. much have you has all this sort of changed you the last couple of weeks, your habits? Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, I definitely think it's giving me more confidence. Um, just being in the gym, getting my shot better. Um, my shot has improved a little bit over the past two weeks. Um, so definitely being in there is good for me. And, I mean, it's not just me. It's a lot of people that are – that have just started coming in the gym a lot as of late, so that's a good thing. Is it fair to say you had gotten comfortable with where you were or whatever? I mean, not putting in the kind of work that he would want, extra work he would want to see? Uh, I mean, I guess I guess, I guess that's the reason. I don't know. <laughs> Jared, how important is, you know, the next couple of weeks, no school, just all basketball? Um, I mean, this is when Cal's teams usually get a lot better. Um, we have nothing to worry about, absolutely nothing. Um, just basketball for the next two weeks. So we have nothing else on our minds, and hopefully we can get better. How did you see the last couple Cal teams? What strides did you see them make uh, in this period in the last couple of years? Um, I don't know. It's kind of kind of when we came together really as a team. Um, I mean, last year we watched a film of last year's team, and we were the best or whatever, but we were beating Portland by like eight at halftime. So he was like, it's not really the score, but um, – we could just we watched the film and they were playing just way harder than we were playing right now. Just getting up in people, so the only thing just playing harder is what we're going to work on. Jared, coach said you guys improved about that much after five days. Does that concern you? Uh, I mean, it should. Yeah, I, mean, I think we're trying hard, but um, just trying to put together a 40-minute game of competing hard and playing hard is kind of what we're struggling at. Um, I mean, we've had a hard week, tough week of practice, and I think it did help a little, like you said, but. At the same time, we know we have a, far, a long way to go, and he knows that. So hopefully the next two weeks and on will help us. Now that you're out of finals, how much tougher is Camp Cal going to be? Um, probably a lot tougher. We're going to be around each other literally all day for two weeks, whether it's breakfast or dinner or practice, another practice. So um, we're going to get to know each other a lot more, and hopefully that will pay off on the court. Sort of the storyline of this team, everybody talks about there's not a lot of veterans, but you obviously are one. Do you try to – do you try to be that guy when you see this team struggling, you know, being in the gym more, maybe by example or vocally leading this group? Yeah, I mean, me and Kyle have been getting in the gym every day before practice with KP. Um, and just whenever I'm on the court, I'm just trying to bring energy because that's I know that's what we need. So um, just trying to show an example, I guess you could say. You and Kyle, you know, seem like 